you're always so stoic. It's that New York state of mind. But after you kiss the floor, you raise your hands in the air like Ali. Talk about that emotion you had right there. What did that mean for you at that moment? Uh, I, I was just trying to be goofy, honestly. <laughs> it, it was no reason. I, well, there's still some celebration, though. Yeah, yeah, I was just trying to give people something to laugh at, honestly. You know? It, was, it wasn't nothing to it. So, even with that, how do you feel right now? Uh, I feel good. Uh, I ain't cry. I got all that out the way yesterday and stuff, so it was all good. Last thing, you got out the way yesterday. What was going on to put you in that frame of mind to have those emotions come out then? Compared to now, uh, you know when you just when you just think like, damn, like it's over, you know, time really flew by. So, but it, it was all right though. It's good. It's good to cry. It is. John, well done. Over here on your right, Chris. I'm wondering about those last maybe 12 minutes um, when you started attacking North and South. Um, I, I guess what's going through your head at that point when things got close again after that stretch when Malik and uh, AJ early were kind of getting things going? Uh, just trying to be aggressive, um, trying to get fouled, although it doesn't really happen, but just trying to be aggressive. Uh, the jump shots wasn't falling, so just had to figure out things out. Um, I have two questions, but my first question is, uh, what, how, how, Izzo was talking about the run that he thinks that you guys have and you got, and, Malik kind of talked about it too. Just what do you think is the potential for this group? And what is a win like this where you guys had to, you know, fight to the end on senior night when their emotions are high do for you guys moving forward? Um, winning the game and only scoring 53, that, that's big. You know, we played a lot of defense. Uh, we did some, some good things. So just we, we haven't really put a full game together, you know, offensively and defensively, like for the whole time. So when we get that going, uh, it's a totally different game. And then uh, my second question, just about the playing in the, this atmosphere for the last time, they were chanting air ball for like two minutes straight mm -hmm. during that timeout. Like, I what, love the air ball what, chant. What was that favorite. just like as like a player? Uh, yeah. That's my favorite. In practice, I do it all the time, air ball. That's my favorite. So it, it was cool. And it, it was real loud, too, uh, when they do it. But I feel like this is the best place to play at. Um, you know, every time when I start making shots and the crowd gets going, it, it doesn't get old. And I, I tell all the freshmen and sophomores that, like, when you have your moment, it, it's the like, best feeling in the world. Tyson, you guys lost back to back at Breslin for this game. You, you lost at Purdue. What does this win on senior night mean to a guy like you who's, who transferred in from here and, and has bought into the mentality of the recent years? What does this mean to you specifically? Uh, it, it means a lot to win on senior night. Um, you know, I don't even really feel like I transferred in. It's been three years now. You know, so I, I feel like I, I've been here forever, it feels like. But, uh, you know, you just can't lose your last one here. That's that's bad. It ruins the celebration. So it was good to win. Down front, Jack. Dyson, it's senior night, but Trey had both of the twos, those four big free throws, um, 12 points, all the 12 bench points. How much did he help you guys in coming off? Uh, he helped a lot. Uh, he might have been the only one to make a three, right? Yeah, that helped for sure. Uh, without that, we would, I don't know. But just him coming in, being aggressive, uh, we need that off the bench. Uh, we got to win the bench battles, you know, because if we can score off the bench and then they don't, then it help, it's a plus for us. Tyson, I'm curious uh, how, like, you personally and maybe how you saw the team sort of navigate the idea of pressure in this game being as important as it was for you guys and, and where you want to go. Uh, j just trying to win a game, uh, not trying to lose four in a row. Um, so we had to do everything we could. Uh, well, there's the big things, little things, just trying to do everything to win. Also wanted to ask you about defending Boo. Like I asked Malik, you were obviously on him a lot. Just what are the challenges of, of a guy like him? How have you seen him evolve over your time here? And are you glad that you might not have to, you guys might have to face him again? You know, it's tough to, to stop somebody when, it, like, they have the ball. You know, they got all the decisions to make for their team. No, so I think I did a pretty good job today, uh, just slowing him down. You know, he still got his shots, still scored, but just slowing him down. I think I did a pretty good job. Over here on your right, Chris. I wonder about the toughness factor in this game, because you mentioned the 53 points, and Coach talked about this being a rock fight. The job you guys did in terms of getting extra possessions, doing a lot of little scrappy things that maybe don't show up on this, um, I, I guess is, 
is that an identity that this team wants to try and get down the stretch and build on? Uh, yeah. Uh, you know, diving on the floor, uh, we had 19 offense rebounds today. That might be a high since I've been here. So just, just getting to the glass, you know, shots weren't falling, but second chance points or getting fouled after rebounds, uh, just, just doing little things. Anything else? One more. Uh, 2,000 career points, what did that mean to you personally? And did you know how many you were away coming into the night? Uh, Coach Wodes uh, kept the countdown on his desk since. So, you know, he, he just kept reminding me. Uh, but it means a lot. Not too many people have it, you know, especially with the other things I have, the steals, the assists. So it means a lot. It means I can put the ball in the hole, too. So. <laughs> Thanks, Tyson. Thanks, everybody. Thank you.